Hey guys, and welcome back to Terra Tech with me, Tenzin. How are you guys doing today? I hope you guys are having a good day. I'm having a good day. So, uh, we did a little bit of a build, base build here. Uh, the tower. <laughs> uh, but you know what? Uh, it was a little bit of a road to get there. Um, I tried out some different stuff, and I recorded it. So, I guess I'll, we'll jump, well, we'll jump into that montage so you guys can see what I was trying to do and what we couldn't accomplish. All right? I'll see you guys in a second. Alright, so that's what we tried. So obviously there's a length, as you guys can see in that, that uh, you can only go with the blocks a certain distance, and then it won't let you go any further. So, yeah, I was going to build a nice big base around this and all that. And I was like, well, what for, right? Uh, we're just here to get some money, because we're only down at 53 bucks now. <laughs> and then we're going to move on. So, because we have all these quests out to do up here so that'll be fun um uh, we'll just yeah i don't know we'll see how well we can forge around here i hope you guys like the front of the tank now got four barrels i didn't want to put any mini guns on here because just because of the spacing that they require also is just i don't know and they make a ton of noise <laughs> plus we have six geo batteries we're using the gso shield bubbles and uh, oh, what is it? The Hawkeye repair bubbles. So I haven't even tried this out yet, and as you can see, we are nose heavy. Kind of looks like everything's kind of dipping down in the front, but I don't mind it. Uh, so let's just get out there. Let's start killing some guys. And oh, and by the way, we have one uh, SCU unit here on the back for the collection because I was gonna use the receiver pads. But for what? We'll just bring it over, we'll drop it all on the ground, and then it can get sucked up over there. But there's another SCU unit on top of this tower, so that was kind of nice. Well, makes life a little bit easier for us. Um, I might put some of the receiver pads on here just strictly so that uh, when um, we're doing stuff like this where there's you know a ton of blocks laying all over the place. We can just grab them right away. 
but it would almost be nice to have four or five of them, like drop this one, go over here, kill this guy, drop one. We might have to do that. I'll have to keep that in mind. Um, I think in an episode, we're going to kind of like set up a bunch of test dummies. In a sense, like test towers slash, uh, you know, just something to shoot at. And we're going to test out which cannons and weapons are the best. Uh, I don't know if it'll be the next one, but it'll be shortly. So stay tuned for that, you guys, if you're curious about which weapons are actually the strongest, which cannons are shoot the, or cannons or guns shoot the hardest and or strongest. <laughs> What's best to outfit your tank with that you're about to send to another place, another player's um, world to invade, right? But these, uh, these Hawkeye cannons, yeah, they made short work of this guy, so. Um, I don't know if I showed you guys this lately. We have a lot of blocks that are worth selling, like these Geocorp Basics. We have 718 of them now. So, do you think we're ever going to use 718? I'm guessing probably not. Not in one solid build. Uh, especially since um, it looks like there's a limit to the width that you can go. So, we might actually end up selling two or three hundred of them. So, what we're doing right now isn't... Uh... Oh. Um, not crucial. We have the money. I just thought I would, you know, I don't, I just, like, I feel like we go and we go and we go and we always fight and destroy stuff, but I don't know if we ever go over, like, a lot of harvesting and stuff like that. Like, what's the, I guess there's nothing, like, too in-depth about harvesting, right? That's kind of interesting watching all four of the barrels just point right inward towards them. It's like, yeah. Gotta get them to fire on that. <laughs> yeah. Hawkeye's uh, cannon turrets are pretty sick. Yeah, which one are you firing at? I don't want to lose the base, because then it's going to tell me that the mission is lost. Uh, okay, let's kill this guy over here first. <laughs> Look at that. And boom. Uh, yep, okay, so the base is ours. Nice. Uh, we've collected a million of them before. But... Oh, you know what? I think this one glitched in. Well, it didn't glitch in, it just didn't come down properly. You see the wheels here? Or I don't know. Looks like they wanted to make it a base. I don't know. Please tell me you're not stuck. Yeah, it attached itself to the base. Sorry, you guys. This will just take a second. I'll show you how to... Ah, there's... I have to get rid of this AI unit. Yeah, the graphics are a little bit glitchy at this moment, just in case any of you guys are noticing those little black spots popping up every once in a while. Um, I noticed that just came into effect, so... Okay, let's save. There we go. I wish <laughs> I, wish I would've, we would have learned that, like, what, 20 episodes ago? 30? <laughs> That helps so much when you just, when you take that block off that the uh, unit is sitting on and it just destroys the rest of it. It makes it so easy to collect everything. But, um, yeah. Uh, we'll kill some of these guys. Um, yeah, I don't know. This is just a heart, like... This vehicle or whatever we have here is more or less a, like a harvesting one, right? Just to make sure that we can kill these guys. Um, I didn't really set it up for travel, right? So, I think... 
trying to think here what we could do for traveling. Because um, we do have all these... Because I don't know, it might only be this episode where we're sitting here. We might actually get enough money from the 200 or whatever to make... I don't know, I, I, I liked the flyer last time, like that plane we made. But it just wasn't big enough. After I, <laughs> after I edited the movie and, or the video and stuff like that, I was looking at it and I was like, you know, if I made that two times bigger, or maybe even three times bigger, it would look awesome. But, once again, requires money. So, what are we doing? We gotta collect it. Ah. Uh, Alright, let's get over here. So what kind of quests do we have here? It's mostly we've got hostels. Oh, we have... Some, oh, okay, we can't make a flyer. Because we have to... Hold on, hold on. we got to find the invaders, and I believe there's an invader on the map, isn't there? I thought there was, at least. Okay, see what I mean by this thing? Which should be attacking that? Oh, but I didn't put, uh... Okay, let's see here. I don't know how much time we have. Oh, there we go. And... He's not doing anything. Oh, we gotta take over. <laughs> no choice. So the AI unit's not the greatest, not reliable, I guess you'd say. Um, uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, the joys of a cannon, right? Yeah, I thought there was an invader on this, the map right now. Uh, must not be, I guess. Um, or somebody just they not somebody destroyed it but it ran into uh ran into other guys which then destroyed it right so actually let's go over here let's do this quest it might be on here i doubt it question mark so never know could be something interesting could be hawkeye okay that's right, we're too, um, too much nose on here and not enough wheels to lift it up off the ground. Wow. <laughs> okay, somebody likes gas tanks. Uh -huh. Oh, there's two of them. Well, two of, two of the exact same looking one, at least. <laughs> oh, gas tanks and batteries. <laughs> All right. Ah, uh, come on. Are we stuck? So, there's a downfall to having our tech the way it is. How did we miss him? Let's go over here, pick up that stuff like so. Um, let's get rid of these techs right here, because... But yeah, I think instead of making a flying tech, we will actually make um, another tank, better tank than this. Probably go big again. Uh, unless you guys want to see something else, like other than large bots. And, like, we haven't even made, like, the largest either, but... Of course... I don't know, sometimes I'm just really picky about how... How big it has to go. <laughs> Alright, so, we have that. I'm gonna show you guys, because I don't think... We've never set this up before. Or maybe... I, yeah, no, sorry, I have. 
Yeah, just get sucked up there. Okay, whatever. <laughs> so what we're gonna do... We'll set this here. Like, oops. Maybe if we set two of them up, it won't be so bad. That's the one problem with... I guess it's not a problem, but it's really hard to navigate sometimes. Which camera angle you can use to actually stick stuff to the ground. There, there. Okay, we have to move this. We'll start it up, because... Oh! There's still more of a quest over here. Yeah. Oh, this is Hawkeye, it sounds like. I'm guessing. Four of them? Yep. <laughs> Can't even stand their own weapons. <laughs> I'm kind of glad that the... Uh, the Hawkeyes that do pop in aren't that large. Otherwise, it would be hard to deal with them, but, uh... I'm sure they will eventually be very large. And if not, when somebody sent, you know, the invaders will be. Oh. Okay, let's go over here. Uh, actually, we have to babysit this for a second, because that's too far away. Don't need to be running back and forth for it. Come on, Mega Mad, you did. Stumbled into the wrong area. Why don't we just shoot out there? Oh. <laughs> you know what? Just because I want to play around, let's do this. I want to play around just a little bit here. Oh, yeah. Here we got some stuff stuck here. Okay. Go like that. Go like that. Oh, we got to do this more often. Kind of the wrong guy that <laughs> was trying to point us back to the base, but since he's in our way, might as well kill him. He's a little close to the base, so we can just say that he was a threat. That didn't last long at all. But his wheels will catch up, bring us 3,200. So, I just wanna... Uh, and all those... All of these uh, tools. Bring about 1,000 apiece, which is really good. I think if we could maintain about 200000 or even $100,000 all the time, we wouldn't have nearly as much problems as we are now, having to stop, go, stop, go, kind of thing. Uh, okay, let's drop this S unit. I'm going to drop it somewhere where... Let's put it over here. Really? What a pain in the butt, eh? Huh? Oh, at least, at least he's dropping his parts off. <laughs> oh, come on. Yeah, you're done. <laughs> not bad, not bad. So we're making... I don't even have to really show you guys that then. Uh, oh, I do. I'm glad that this one didn't have time to... grab him up. Watch over this one. Oh, you know what? I didn't even see that we had the speedometer on here. Let's see. How fast do we get going with these rockets? Oh, we're like borderline being able to take off. <laughs> so I think it's uh, about 100 miles an hour you need for... Uh, 
the Hawkeye gas tanks repair or refill really quickly too. But anyway, sorry. Uh, don't want to get. So yeah, we have these two pads set up. I think I showed you guys this before, but just in case. Let's go like that. Oh yeah, it's 704. Some of these are getting just a little, oh, that SCU unit's just a little too close to this pad. Drop it on the ground. Okay, there we go. So yeah, I think uh, I'll do all the rest of the selling off camera. Um, yeah, we'll set up some targets for the next episode. Um, I'll make a small... Yeah, like a small tank, or a little small vehicle to shoot at it, <laughs> and then we uh, we'll find out which which weapons are the best. Probably break everything down, and we'll head out, finish as many of these quests as we can. Sorry about that, you guys. Yeah, there's quite a few. We've got hostels and gangland and stuff like that. We still have to max out GSO. We haven't done it yet, so. Um. Yeah, that's what we'll do next episode. Alright, so if you guys liked the episode, please leave a like, leave a comment, and if you haven't already, please subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.